Total Story by Zach Keller and somebody else. Episode director by. Da -da -da. Didn't even see it. Art direction Martin McDonald. Ugh. Putting my words out. Oh. Is this. It's me. The Bat Cave. Oh, nice! So blue, <laughs> episode one. Realm of Shadows. Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. Apparently, the bandits are using stolen GCPD battery rams to force their way in. What? They had the tickets from the... Why would they be out? Why would you look at those? He got blood on him from his parents. Grim. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. <laughs> oh, I thought she stole it. Uh, huh. Hmm, data drive. Let's see what we can like see. Movie ticket. Why would I look at that? That's <laughs> grim. I don't look at that. The cow. Look at the cow. Lenses. Voice modulation. Wayne Enterprise has really outdid themselves with this version. <laughs> yeah, I thought he had like a bit of a voice modulator in there. A bit like the old Ben Affleck. Can I go down here? Oh, let's go see the car! Look, I'm in the Batmobile. Have I got anything else? Have I got like a the Batwing or anything? Uh, no, I guess it's just the car. Well, then it's going to be sweet if we can drive that. Examine the Batmobile. Oh man, that is awesome looking. The stuff. Oh wow, that's such a good looking Batmobile. Man, it's like a action man sort of car. That's what he sort of used to drive. <laughs> the sort of like red sports car thing. Never did get that. I always wanted it. Never got it. <laughs> uh, look at Scrabble. Can't believe I let her take. Oh, that's what she stole. Right, I get you. Well, the test run at the mayor's office was a success. So now she can, like, grapple <laughs> and stuff. Come on, come on. EMP sticky taser. Or knock out electricity in the area. I suppose that cat woman would have preferred the latter. Ah, interesting stuff. Oh, and he's got the... Batarang. Let's see if I can refine the edge. Could be sharper. Hmm? Is that everything? Oh, what's this? Trace detection. Newest skin. edition. You can program it to reveal trace elements in a confined space. What is that? Is that like a drone? Right, back in. Um, data device. What else we got? We got the codex. It says updated. Oh, right, so we can, like, look at... Pose dad as a physician. Oh, right, so we can get, like, any, like, information on these guys. I'll quickly go through them, and then if you guys, like... If you want to read them, you can just pause the video and then... Have a look. Who's this? Mayor of Gotham. Oh, right, we haven't seen him yet, I don't think. Catwoman. Let's see what this is about Catbird. New criminal on the scene, tied to several recent bank... Oh, break-ins. Um, she's effective and doesn't leave many clues behind. Currently, the GCPD has nearly... I wish I knew more about her. Oh, I bet you do. Oh, I bet you do. Penguin? What? Oswald Cobblepot. Childhood friend. Hmm. Here's James Gordon. And Vicky Vale. <laughs> Damn. Nice. And... Uh, Cohen. 
Gotham. Population 10 million. Jeez. The city is like a living creature. It's always growing out and up with the people who live here are survivors. They have to be. And they deserve better than the corruption that infests this place. Arkham Asylum, that looks cool. Looks like Hogwarts. <laughs> and Wayne Enterprises, that looks mint. Nice, I think that's all of it. Cool. Um, Gotham Feed? What is this? Oh, is this like a newspaper thing? No, I'm not bothered about that. What's this guy going on about still? <laughs> Vesper Fairchild, who's that? Oh, was that just her? Ace Chemical. Ooh, I wonder, like, who that is. I'm not too familiar with, like, Batman. Uh, might as well look at the movie tickets as well. I'm not too familiar with all the Batman villains, but... I do know quite a few. I'm not sure who that would be, though. In the, uh, the fire or whatever. If it was hinting to a baddie. should be able to read whatever data is on that stolen drive. Oh, right, okay. That's what we've got to do then. So let's look at the drive and put it in our computer. We really fell off a building for this. Okay. Here we go. What? How unnecessary. <laughs> why Why don't you just have a chair there all the time? That's why that was so important. <laughs> why, why, why would you have that? I mean, if I had the money in there, yeah, why not? I guess. Encrypted. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. Hmm. Alfred's in bragging. In a dark, damp cave. I'll leave as soon as I finish. People with regular jobs can do their work anywhere, but for me, this is my office. I agree. <laughs> it isn't normal work. Even worse, the best outcome is that no one ever finds out you've done it. Yeah, well, good deeds usually go unnoticed. Uh, though not unappreciated. Did you find out what that um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. What are we I'm looking on at? I'm on it, Alfred. Let me try I'm on a it. Different angle. To rotate the hologram, use L. Oh, here we go. So what am I doing? What am I doing? This is a map of the east side shoreline. But it could mean any number of things. Trust me to go the wrong way. Money, weapons, drugs. <laughs> the first Everything time. flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, so. Mm hmm. Yeah, the same couldn't be said for the bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Good. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat, I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. I had everything under control. That's true. I've seen you take down worse thugs. But I'd already sewn you up once tonight, and I had no interest in a repeat performance. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back it's because he was a good one. man. It can again, Bruce. Though so people like this cat woman aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Hopefully, she's just a tourist. Hmm. No, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. 
few burglaries, break-ins. Seems to lay pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. As Bruce or Batman. I don't like being compared to a common criminal. No, I think you're missing the point. You have to admit you've been drawing a lot of attention to yourself, and not the playboy billionaire buys new yacht kind of attention. <laughs> I don't mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Billionaire's Trust yacht. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spot more than Nick. ever. You have to be careful. You're right, yeah. you're right. I should have cancelled the event. But I know how much pressure you're under. I don't mean to add to it. It's okay. No. I, I know you're only looking out for me. If we make a suit that fits me, we can trade places some night. Though mm. I'm not partial to heights. I doubt that, uh, Alfred. <laughs> don't men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. We need to like listen to Alfred because you know he's the wise old guy. Let's let's give him a chance. Park six a.m. I thought I saw Oz. It's been what twenty years. Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Indeed, you two were thick as thieves. Oswald, hmm. however, took that role more literally than you. What was that like stain on that card? Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stents? That's a criminal grand slam, if I'm using the expression correctly. Unfortunately, you are. Oswald claimed he only wanted to catch up, but his behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. He's gone to pop. Why he's returning now, I haven't the faintest idea. Do you think he might know something about the break-in? This Catwoman shows up around the same time Oswald comes back to town. Might not be a coincidence. Mm. Oswald's crimes, numerous they may be, are on a much smaller scale than robbing City Hall. Well, he was always trouble growing up, but it's the fun kind of trouble. You both were. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. But yeah. I know you can't we abandon can't trust a good him. mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. Mm -hmm. I bet it's a shady place now. Full of... ...baddies. I don't know. <laughs> the one that got away. Okay, Cobblepot Park. Wait, well, he actually owns the park. I think that's what you're saying about his family's like... ...they were good as well. Where are you, Oz? Hmm. I could give that guy some money. What am I doing? I'm just like <laughs> ignoring it. Newspaper. Okay, so we can't really go anywhere. Um, what's this newspaper say? Whoops. What? You just like skip that. <laughs> uh, what does it say? Homeless person. <laughs> Examine. <laughs> What else did it say? What was the other option? I mean, give give change. Yeah, we're we'll giving some change. I mean, I'm, I'm loaded, right? I'll probably just spend on alcohol, though. <laughs> Thank you, sir. He's got bottles around him. Hmm. Is there anywhere else? Anything else? Oh, man. I didn't want to go. <laughs> so I guess we'll have to just look at these bits from down here. What's that like graffiti? That looks interesting. Graffiti. Is that like code or anything? No. No. I think it's just it's just a rough area. Recent newspaper. <laughs> Falcone. Wayne shoots Falcone at the front door. <laughs> Did that say? <coughs> oh, at fundraiser probably. I missed it. Can I give this guy some money? He looks cold. He looks like he could use the money. He's just got a, a shopping trolley. Anyway, let's go see Penguin. Oh, <laughs> Cobblepot. I wonder why they call him Penguin on this one. 
was like, what's the reason? Burning barrel. <laughs> what is this? Seven days to die. <laughs> what? Why did you wear a coat, Bruce? Running late, meet you by the statue. Oh, right. Well, there's the statue, but no eyes. We need to be careful. This could be like a setup or something. Could be like planning to mug me. Uh, look at shopping cart. <laughs> Why can he examine like everything? Just casually looking at shopping cart. Yep, that's a shopping cart. Just what I thought. Just like that other shopping cart. <laughs> Smoking man. Talk to him. Hey. Beat it. Friendly. <laughs> Is that it? It's just a game. <laughs> Graffiti. <laughs> yep. It's graffiti, alright. <laughs> What's the plaque say? Cover Pop Park, established 27. what it used to be. September. Missed it. Hmm. Well, I guess we're just, like, waiting for... Let's look at the statue. Graffiti's just graffiti, isn't it? Let's look at the statue. So is that Cover Pop's dad? He probably knows him if it is. I hope. Watch Wallet Cash. Huh? But this goes through you. Hey, you heard him, man. The hell are you waiting for? Just walk away. You're making a mistake. You already made one. Come in here. The next one kills you. And him. <laughs> Kidding me. Gentlemen. Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp. You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. Oh, jeez. Come here. Think that'll do? Oh, we need to, like, not give away that we're Batman, though. <laughs> Just slow that. Oh, man! You don't threaten Batman with a gun. Oh, nice! This used to be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Oh, jeez! Oh my god! This is my park! Mine! You oh my that? god, I'm just wrecking these people. <sighs> oh, He's hey covered Bruce, in blood. You've got a little, uh... Ew! Uh, good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Thank you. Well, thanks for the backup. Mm -hmm. I yanked you away from your bloody ivory tower, Bruce. Least I can do is make sure you don't get shanked. We need to play it like oh, we just right, finished one. Yeah, it's been what? Two decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, that wasn't why I brought you here, mate. Right now, I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. I wonder Back if he set them guys up. You know, like this. This park used to mean something. That's why they need to a wait for him at the statue. For kids, maybe. For families. People came from all over to visit. Oh, Mum and Dad, they put so much work in here. It's a shame what happened. It was beautiful once. And now it's a hellhole. Last thing my parents ever built. Well, <sighs> get working on it then. Choose right through. Just people. blame it on other people. Mum committed to Arkham. Dad ended it yourself, he did. Oh, jeez. My family's fortune. There's nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. Is it a rough time? <sighs> it's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. I'm... I'm sorry, Oz. 
No one should have to go through. It's not all about my parents. Thanks, <laughs> but we are not the only ones suffering. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Exactly. I'm Batman. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Balcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home. That oily... No, 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 no. I only agreed to meet him because of Harvey. Beware of any man who smiles that much, Bruce. They're usually hiding the forked tongue. Ooh. Balcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. And... Ooh, he's looking to do Falcone. To watch him in pavement. Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are going to be on the upswing soon, though. Probably leave him to it though, to be fair. Revolution is knocking on the door. It. <laughs> and I'm here to let it in. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, <laughs> we just smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not gonna be pretty. Is that it's a threat? It's gonna be beautiful. Are you threatening me, Oz? Take it as you like. Oh. I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Sounds like a threat to me. Better watch your back, Oz. Good seeing you, Bruce, but I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. <laughs> Got some rocks to collect. Like, smash some windows. Don't you dare. Oh, phone's going off. Press conference. The new hospital starts soon. Car waiting on such, such car park. <laughs> and there we go. We've met Penguin. We've met Catwoman. We've met Two Faces. Harvey Dent. Falcone. Oh, there's Arkham. Arkham Asylum. Next to a shipping container. What, they're pulling down Arkham? Oh, that's a nice car. That is nice. Mr. Wayne, over here. Right here. This way. They're pulling down Arkham then to like build the hospital. Good morning, everyone. Let's be polite. We're in public. Good morning, Mr. Dent. Mm -hmm. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> we didn't bring you all out here to Just discuss cars, jokes, honestly. Casual. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Alfred needs to talk. Mm. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, I can't ignore it. <laughs> and worse still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous than before they went in. Call Arkham Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, oh God. <laughs> a sizable contribution from this man here we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Bruce? No, oh, let's make it quick. My parents loved Gotham. They invested their blood, sweat, and tears in this city. Hmm. <sighs> You know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero mm -hmm. who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice. Sound no familiar? matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man <clears throat> who needed the kind of help this new facility 
will provide. Let's come full circle. My With this facility and our next mayor, my hope is in Harvey to make sure a night like that never happens again. There we go. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Nice. Just give me goosebumps. I'm uh, sure you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this yeah, new he hospital, likes Ms. Vale. what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? I don't blame it. What him. happens to the old building? I think Arkham has only done harm to Gotham. It's made criminals more unstable, put our citizens in jeopardy. We can do better. Yeah. All right, who's up next? We sure can. Uh, and know. we will. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. Oh! You even spoke with him behind closed doors. Um. Oh. I don't make friends with gangsters. He was an <laughs> unwelcome guest. That's all. Savage. Next question. Say it like please. it is. Please keep your questions on topic, people. Yeah. We're here about the hospital, remember? Oh, uh, we need to. Can't ignore it. GCP. But Mr. Wayne, this oh morning God, the what's happening? Evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? What? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Oh, jeez. Care to comment? <laughs> and did anyone else receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family... Oh, my God. Well, oh, God. Did you now it's gone. This, Bruce? How long has your family it's been gone to pop. <laughs> Could the allegations be true? What aren't you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' paychecks? <laughs> I think you should check your source. Sounds to me like an intern is finally putting their creative writing minor to good use. Yeah, Mr. just deny. Mr. Deny. Wayne. Deny. <laughs> deny all the way. Could the allegations be true? Can I just be like, I ain't standing for this. Did you know about this, Bruce? What are you telling us? Oh, I'm God, they're going. Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage control's my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please, settle down. <laughs> I'll take your questions from here on out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. I need to make a phone call. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. What? What are they doing? Meet the press. <laughs> Trophy earned. I bet Falcone's like stitch me up or something. This is his threat come good. Oh, bit of lag there. Oh, bit more lag. Dropping hey, frames. Hey, careful. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. What are you doing? It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. There's got to be a mistake. That's what we're here to find out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you did. About what? Alfred, keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. More for though, he's not even said. I meant what I said about not personal. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Your holdings are extensive. Yeah, and what do you, do you expect to find? That's for our analysts back at the precinct to figure out. I can't comment. I thought that I had to it's tell you. Warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. I thought it was like your right to know. He calls the shots. Okay, so you just do whatever Mayor Hill says. <sighs> oh, low blow. Hill and I, we have a vested interest to keep things professional. For Gotham's sake. Doesn't mean I like the words whistling through his windpipes. 
I mean, I don't you know, know if the mayor's corrupt yet. Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. We have Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. That'd be a real shame. Uh, Mr. Dent's the only DA sense. I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sakes, I pray you've got nothing to hide. Thank you.